Hey everyone, Tony Phelan here with Competition X and today, boom, we're going to be unboxing one of Castle Creation's new Mamba Monster X sensored systems. Castle Creations has been all about super duper power for the longest time. The one thing they've always been missing out though is a sensor system, something that gives you that really nice feel when you're driving on rocks or crawling or something like that. Now they have it. Uh, this is perfect for, according to the box, ideal for 1 8 scale off-road and on-road vehicles as well as 1 10 scale four-wheel drive SCTs. Uh, it works up to 4S LiPo. I actually put one of these systems in a, an axial rig, it went out rock crawling and it, the feel of it is fantastic. Uh, so let's just get into the box here. It's got a nice uh, plastic wrapping on the back. Uh, and it comes with two boxes inside. One is obviously the uh, speed control. It's a nice looking box here. Has your uh, sensor port adapter here. This can be run actually censored or sensorless. Thus the extra wire here if you want to hook it up to a censored system. Uh, it's you know the, the standard foam blocks that come inside castle systems. Off to the side there. It also has the uh, driver's head, basically an instruction manual, and some sticker sheets and a quick start guide. Um, I'll take some close-up photos of this, but this is a really good-looking system. Uh, it's got a plastic case, large fan on top. It's already pre-wired, and there is a port. It's actually a port right on the back here. It's got a plug in there. You unplug that and you stick this in, and you got censored system. You got a censored system. Uh, it also comes with, as a combo, it comes with a 1512 motor. Uh, it is a um, 1800 kV. It's got long wires on it. The great thing about this now is the fact that these wires are soldered onto the motor. They don't go directly in. So if you want to shorten these but keep these plugs, you can cut them here and shorten the wires. It's a really cool feature that I'm glad they finally implemented. Uh, also in this box is more foam. Uh, a censored setup guide. And more foam. Oh, and a sensor wire, hall wire. So basically, once you get this installed in your vehicle, the setup is as easy as plugging these wires in. You have an A, B, and C on the back. And you have a large A, B, and C on the side here. So basically, A goes to A. Ah, these are a little tight. That's good, that means they're never gonna fall out. B goes to B. Yeah. Be a gorilla to get these in and C goes to C there we go take your censored wire here take off the little doodad uh, these are um, they do go in a certain way so just make sure when you do that you take your time and put them in and go the right way and then this plugs into here And that plugs into the port there. I think this is uh, requires like pliers to get out of here, so I'm not going to actually do it here. Let me see. Yeah, give me a second. And we're back. Needed a pair of pliers. So basically, you just reach in there and pull this little tab out there. Take your sensor port wire, and something cool that they've done is they've given you a guide so you cannot put this in backwards. If you can see it, there's a bunch of black wires and one white wire. On the side there, it gives you, gives you a diagram. A bunch of black wires, a white wire. So you make sure you put it in correctly. And voila, complete sensor system ready to put in your vehicle, get going. Once again, Castle's come out with a really great system. It looks amazing, the quality is top notch. The motor is like solid. Speed controller, great. Head over to competitionx.com to see more reviews, and please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.